hey there welcome back to my channel and this is another how to quick guide okay so today I'm going to answer a very popular question and that is how to set your tents and tripods for a great one grind all right so I already set up my tents and tripods for this grind as you can see on the map now one very important thing that everybody should know and understand where this is concerned your tripod and tent setup will never be the same as someone else's tripod or tent setup on their map because first of all not all zones on every player's map will be located at the same place all right so or at the same spot they might they will be at the same lakes but zones can appear in different spots at each lake okay so on my lake you might have or say um on my wife's map right she plays Rev on Thule as well and she's got her um, whitetail grind set up as well. Now her tent and tripod placements are much different from mine because her lake, I can't pronounce this, Cock Sosek uh, Lake. This, I'm gonna use this lake as an example. She has her first zone right here, just like mine. Her second zone is located somewhere here where my tripod right here is set up and then she has another zone right there and she has one more right there and the zone right there so for her to set up a tripod her tripod and tents just like mine it would not work out for her right because setting up your tripod and your tent you've got to keep in mind um, the wind now if you can see at the bottom right hand corner where you see that compass that um, determines the wind direction now every hunter know this you must try never to go downwind where the animal are able to pick up your scent now animals are able to pick up your scent at 200 meters away from you so say I'm going in that direction where you see my waypoint 209 meters away and I mean they can pick up your scent from say 150 meters away I'm sorry if I'm supposed to go straight ahead straight to that waypoint and there's a herd of deer right there they're gonna smell me they're gonna pick up my scent and get spooked by the time I get to 150 or even 175 meters away okay so I'm gonna show you with that being said I'll get right into it okay and remember to hit that like button and hit that subscribe and put your notification to the bell set your notifications so you uh, receive it every time I upload a new video because I've got much of vi much videos um, to do so what I'm gonna do I'm gonna bring a tent with me already got a tripod there but based on my loadout I can't bring both tent and tripod so what I do I bring a tent so when I get to the location where I'm gonna place the tent I just take out a tripod from there because you can always access your storage from a tent okay now I know that there is a and I took went and took this to move my tripod just for this video okay so I could show you guys how to do this now I had a, a zone somewhere down here let me find it where was it 
Oh, right here. Okay. So this zone was right here. So I need to get to the closest tent or tripod or house close to this. Alright. And I'm right here, so I'm gonna have to jump over there and take up the ATV there. Alright. So that's gonna take a while, like a few minutes. So I'm going to pause the video and I'll be back when I get there, okay? Alright, so we're here. And this is the zone that I'm setting up for. So, notice I put my waypoint like a couple meters away from the actual zone. Because the deer or whatever species you're hunting, they are normally not at the exact spot where the zone is. Sometimes they're drinking a couple meters away. As you can see, this zone is located more on land. So sometimes the zone is right here and they're down here drinking or sometimes even over here drinking. You know what I mean? So to be um, safe, not to spook the species you're hunting, you set your waypoint a few meters away from the zone to the direction you're going and always try to go down um not downwind okay so let the wind be blowing the opposite direction from where you're going all right so what i normally do i try to place my tent at least 250 meters away from uh, the zone so in this case i'm gonna put my tent say um, here at say 260 and I like to set my tent facing the, the direction I'm going so once I jump out of the tent I just go straight ahead all right so now I'm gonna get my tripod here Putting their, their load out. Okay. Let's see if the deer they are down there. All right. So we got them right there. Okay. And this zone is a moose zone right here. So that's why I like Revon Tule Coast because it's easy to hunt white deer and moose from the same lakes. So I try to set my tripod 175 meters or even 170 meters away from the, the deer and that won't spook them. But if you go closer than 175 meters once placing your tripod, it's going to spook the deer. So by the time you get to place the tripod, they'll be already gone. So you gotta pay close attention to that. You put your tripod somewhere where once you shoot the deer, it's gonna be easy to access the, um, to get to the spot where they drop. All right. And I think I had a diamond deer somewhere over here, a diamond trophy deer. That's not him there. That's not him. That's not him. Where is he? He was usually somewhere around here. I think they late. But that's how you set up your um your tent and your tripod for your great one grind okay so i hope this video was helpful for you 
and um, I will be doing another video on skills and perk points in the uh, next coming video alright